I posted a video a couple weeks ago asking my viewers if there was anything they'd like to see in a video, and I got one response, and it was by a user called Nate Wheatshelf. Now, on a random tangent, please explain your name. I find it incredibly interesting or confusing or something. If there's a story behind it, please share it with me because I'd like to know. But what Nate asked me to do is a tour of my room. Now, you know I'd love to do a tour of my room, but the lighting down here sucks so much it would just be a bunch of black shapes with me talking. Actually, I think I've done that before, but I don't know if I removed it because of, it was such a shitty video. But he also asked me to show my oldest item and an item that I kept for mem memorabilia's sake or something along those lines. So that's what I'm going to do with this. Uh, this book is the oldest item that I can think of off the top of my head. It's got to be 120 years old. Um, 127 actually. It's a history text about the fur trade and if you can't tell, I've got a fetish for old books. So, yeah, I've got a fetish for old books. Now, as for an item I've kept for memorabilia's sake, I decided to share with you my first guitar I ever got. It's a piece of shit, but I got it when I was six, and my love for the instrument just kind of grew from there. Um, it has seen better days. It's got a broken bridge. It's only got one working string, uh, the rest are really out of tune, well, everything's out of tune, and it's just broken, but this is where my love of music started. Um, I'd attempt to play you a song on this, but, like I said, sound is pretty fucked up, so it'd be a lot of... So, it's not even worth butchering. it. So, sorry mate, I can't give you a tour of my room. Maybe if my ceiling gets ripped off and I get some actual light in here, I may be able to. But I hope this was good enough. So, till next time, and if you've got any ideas or anything you want to see in the video, please just tell me and I'd more, be more than willing to do it.